tonight's performance was absolutely amazing. I think it is so incredibly important that we see music be performed. And so when we diversify who the musicians are, you hear the music so differently. Anybody who has the opportunity to attend The Color of Music, um, you have to come out. You won't be disappointed. It was wonderful. Exposure is the key, so this was just wonderful. It was an honor to be here to see the performance this evening. Uh, the musicians were fabulous. It was beautiful. One of the things I love about this experience is just how enriching it is for your soul. I think it was very impressive to see so many different people from different places, very young, and I was really pleased to be here. The crowd was so um, involved, so even every time I talked or laughed, they laughed back with me, which made my nerves calm down a lot. The piano sounded great, the venue was perfect, I loved it. God showed up and showed out, and when you bring excellence too you know and 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 you've worked on something so long and so hard it just comes together i think having opera speak to us as african americans with our stories she just moved me and it like you said it heals my heart and sacramento is like new Idaho city it brings some energy and a drive that just we play off of we bounce off of and there's no city other than Sacramento that brings an audience so lively and so enthusiastic that follows you along on any story. Quite exquisite, quite exquisite. Uh, the music just filled this hall in such an amazing way. It, it really did the house justice. I'm done my first year here, but I feel like a star. <laughs> the electricity was truly amazing. I loved it, yes. It was frantic and dramatic and exciting and beautiful and flowing all at the same time. I'm a, I'm a black girl dad, so sitting up there and seeing those black women up there doing what they did tonight with excellence, precision, um, it was spectacular. You said breathtaking, it makes you speechless. When you're playing music and you can tell that somebody is really, really receiving it, really receptive to it, you can, you can feel it and it really like, it empowers you to play better. It's so much fun. I really enjoy playing concerts with people that look like me, very talented folks. It was such an honor. These women are geniuses. What power there is, not only in music, but when a black woman does it. Oh, I just learned a lot. I was just sharing. Um, I've always loved to hear organ music, but just to learn the history so much of what Dr. Williams shared with us were these personal anecdotes, which mean a lot in a setting like this. It helps to connect, you know, the person to the audience. I just enjoy performing because you get feedback uh, from the audience. So I really appreciate uh, the time that we put in to present the performance. So it's my first time uh, coming to anything like this. So for me, it's about how can I get younger people to come and experience something that they don't have to wait till they're my age to come in and learn to see our culture in a different light. The experience of recognizing how people can be influenced by a story uh, and how inspirational Dean Dixon's life was, and I wanted to share that with, uh, with others. So it was really enlightening to me, and I guess the, the icing on the cake was to have the opportunity to interview the author. Absolutely amazing. It was like phenomenal. It was better than I expected. Like this is so inspiring. I came in from Arizona because I had heard so much about the color of music. It was worth the trip. And then I love French music, and this organ actually plays French music very well, so I thought, I gotta play something French. You know? <laughs> I said it the first year the color of music was here. This must become a annual tradition in our capital city to highlight the color of music to highlight that classical music is for everyone. What I hope 
is that the color of music is going to continue to grow an even stronger presence in Sacramento. But it was amazing, absolutely loved it. And from the time that my son came in and just sat down, he was stunned. This is his first time seeing an orchestra. I think it was amazing. <laughs> Would you like to come back again? Yes, totally. I felt the energy of the audience, the positivity, the support, and they were really coming along with us in each movement and the story we were trying to tell. So I felt a very strong connection with the audience. I'm feeling great. I'm always energized when I work with Color of Music. So working here in Sacramento has been a real joy. And it was just wonderful to, you know, actually see black musicians perform as an orchestra all together. It was fantastic as always, quite frankly. I never cease to be amazed at the talent and skill that we hear and see from these amazing performers. I, I could say it gets better each year, but honestly the bar is so high, it, it's just amazing. It was outstanding, it was incredible, it was something that people would want more and more and more. And so I'm just so proud to have this here in Sacramento, in the city of Sacramento, and I hope it comes back for many more years. It was the first time playing Mendelssohn Contrito with The Color of Music. The audience was so wonderful and cheerful, and so was the orchestra. So it's really a pleasure to be back and to play such a wonderful piece here. It was just great. I think the community came out, they enjoyed it, uh, they were lifted up, and I think we're just going to grow more um, appreciation for the classical music and certainly for arts in general. I'm elated. Our third year, magnificent, the largest audience we've ever had. And I'm just grateful to the city, all of our sponsors, and to the musicians and you all, my staff, to make this memorable occasion our third year is just really something that I will cherish for many, many years to come.